Here's a quick demonstration on how to use the Use Immersive Reader extension on Chrome. So I went to the Chrome Web Store and I'm going to look for Use Immersive Reader on Websites extension and I'm going to go ahead and add that to Chrome. Since I've already done that, that's why mine shows Remove from Chrome. Once the extension is installed, you can go to a website that has a lot of text and I'm going to highlight web uh, text that I want read to me. So I can left click, hold down and drag to select. On a Chromebook, you can do this as well. I can hold down the left corner of the trackpad and then select all the text that they want. And then you're going to right click on the text and choose the option that comes up and says, help me read this. And remember to right click on a Chromebook, that's a two finger tap on the trackpad at the same time, two fingers down at the same time. Once I choose help me read this, the same text pops up in a new window, but you notice that it looks way different. Now, right now it's in English and you could press play and listen to it read. Four score and seven years ago, our fathers brought forth on this continent a new nation conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that all men are created equal. So we have those options. We can also change how the text looks on the screen. Uh, you can show the parts of speech. That's kind of interesting. You can change the text size if you need to do that for different readers. You can change how it looks. So it kind of gives you some different options like that. The final option here is line focus. You can have that, but here's the option you were looking for, translate. So I'm going to choose a language and then I'm going to say by document and look, the text has now translated into a new uh, language. Now what's the big bonus about this? It actually reads it out loud to you as well in that new language. Hace 87 años, nuestros padres dieron a luz en este continente una nueva nación, concebida en libertad y dedicada a la proposición de que todos los hombres son creados iguales. So if that was maybe a little bit too quick, the voice settings are here that you can change the voice speed and then just male or female. So if I change it to male and slow down it one little bit further, what does that sound like? Oh, by the way, did you see when I clicked on the word? It is an, a dictionary and it's a visual dictionary as well as you can listen to the word. Ahora, ahora. Ahora estamos enfrascados en una gran guerra civil poniendo a prueba si esa nación, o cualquier nación así concebida y tan dedicada, puede perdurar por mucho tiempo. Is it a perfect translation? No, because nothing ever really is a perfect translation using translation tools, but it gets you one step further. You can return back to the original English by clicking at the top, and if you want to return back to the original text, you just hit that back arrow and you're right back on the regular website. Hope this helps you out.